Let's go. So Buckwheat and Millard, they said. It'll pay off, they said. Faster. Let's go! How about joining our band? Hi, oh, mate! Your mug's not familiar. What is it you want? Looking for old Geard von Everick. Ah, that'll be inside. Olgierd von Everick. I'm looking for him. Not here by that name. Can't help wondering. Who are you? Who do we look like? A crew of cutthroats? Or a band of former soldiers who got lucky? Ah, but that's where you err. Cause we're sons of nobles all. <laughs> and daughters. So, gonna tell me who you are? Precisely. The Redanian Free Company. The wild ones, folk call us. Owing to the boar in our coat of arms. I was told I'd find Olgierd von Everek here. Someone's made an arse of you, brother. <laughs> so maybe you can make up for that and help me, brother. Something tells me you and me have got different mams. <laughs> All right, Ungus, you've had your fun. I'm Olgierd. Tell me, what brings you here? No, no, I'm Olgierd. You? Not likely. I'm Olgierd. <laughs> <laughs> You're all old geared, that it? Got it right at last. One man split into three bodies. Not interested in his balls, so which of you's got his brain? <laughs> Not laughing. Guess that means you didn't get the brain. Nope. I'm the one got his fists! <laughs> Go on! Give it to him! Come on! Ah! 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 Ah!
Oh, good. <laughs> You'd fit right in with our band of merry men. Come on, I'll take you to Old Geard. What do they call you? Geralt of Rivia. Bit of advice, Geralt of Rivia. Once you meet Olgird, try and pique his interest. I gotta pique his interest? He's the one who wants a monster dead. Aye, but he don't need you to kill it. So, you want this job? You gotta grab his attention. And he's one to get bored mighty quick. Ottoman, sir. You've a guest. Do you know what types of sculptures fetch the best prices? Statues of deities, busts of kings, and nudes. And what have we here? A naked wench. What do you think of her? I happen to like it. Especially the two ovoid forms. A jester. Good. I don't like men with no sense of humor. They bore me to death. <sighs> I used to like Votticelli. The life he could breathe into a chunk of cold stone. But I look at it now, and it seems just a rock, ideally proportioned, not a flaw on its surface. Painfully perfect. As lifeless and boring as a boulder at the roadside. <laughs> That's better. More interesting, at the least. Very well. And now to the matter at hand. Let's rejoin the company. Partake of some refreshment first. Ataman Olgeard, long may he live! Long live the Ataman! Long live the Ataman! Long live the Ataman! Come and drink with us! Well, we haven't a choice now. Fetch us some wine, dear. And a nibble or two. this some special occasion, or just feel like feasting? Every occasion's special. Today we celebrate a dubbing. Whose? Squire Herodor's new saber. I've hit on a name for her! Fair saber, I dub thee... Traditiana! <laughs> Monster in the sewers. Know anything more? I've no clue what it is. Only that it's deadly. I'd not have bothered had my cook not become its victim. Oh, the way she prepared game had no equal. That why she was in the sewers? To fetch game? Nay. She went to a fair with a sister or cousin, matters not. Daft wench convinced her a prince transformed into a toad lives in the oxen furt sewers. And you know women. Each craves a prince and will wade knee deep through shite to get him. Vissy was no exception in that respect. Now she went, never to return. Wasn't the first, it seems, either. <laughs> hey! Leave her be! Is there any way to treat the Lord of the Manor's daughter? Apologies. Now, where were we? Oh, yes, the contract. So, you'll check it. Just one formality to resolve first. My pay. Never you mind that. Return with the beast's head, and you'll have leave to take anything you wish from here. Awfully generous. Still, I'd prefer to agree a specific amount. Oh, fine. How much would you like? Three? Four hundred crowns? Four hundred and fifty. Agreed. 
And that'll be in addition to whatever memento you wish to take. Consider the beast gone. Confident. Bring me its head, and the reward shall be yours. Papers. Name's Geralt. But I'm gonna call you Puss Peepers. That a problem? Get to the point. Got an offer. Potentially lucrative Puss Peepers. Someone's killed me mate. Name was Clivert. You're to figure out who did it. Then cut the bugger's head off. I'm a witcher, not a manhunter. Kill an awful lot of them, though, don't you? When they deserve it. And my friend's murderer, he don't deserve it. At least hear me out. Clivert dealt fist tech. A few days past, he rode to Bowden to take a delivery. Never came back. Been there? Actually seen his corpse? No. But Clivert was one damned reliable orson. We was to meet. He didn't show. Can only mean he's dead. Find the bastard who did this. Find him and kill him. I'll pay top coin. Need to think it through. Clivert's got a scar on his forehead. Not unlike yours. Spot that, you'll know it's his body. Said I'd think about it. Know what, puss peeps? One look at a bloke and I know what he's made of. You'll do what I ask. I bet anything on it. Look for me in Oxenfurt. The Alchemy Inn on the main square. They eat and drink and smoke and fight and dance Black with pudding. lasses blithe and animal, bonny. But... They stop and shout throughout the night. Singing. Hey, nutty, nutty. That's it, Roach. 